known for its historic architecture and home to the EU headquarters. Brussels is an interesting place to visit in Europe. This is Katie from Creative Travel Guide and today we share the things to know before you go to Brussels. Looking for more travel tips? Make sure to hit subscribe and ring that notification bell. So firstly, let's look at the best time to visit. As with many destinations in Europe, spring is a lovely time to visit Brussels as the weather becomes warmer. If you are interested in visiting the famous flower carpet event in the Grand Place, this typically takes place in August every other year, which can be a great time to explore the outdoor activities, but expect a more crowded city with higher hotel prices. Fall offers pleasant weather and the changing colours of the leaves in the park are just magical, making Brussels a picturesque place to explore when visiting in September and October. But our favourite time to visit Brussels has to be in the winter when the Christmas markets, decorations and holiday activities bring the city to life. So now let's look at getting there. Brussels is well connected to various places in Europe, with the Brussels International Airport being around 12 kilometers northeast of the city center. This connects the city to various destinations around the world. You can also catch the Eurostar from London, Paris or Amsterdam, or use the international bus companies that operate more affordable buses from major cities in France and the UK. So now let's look at getting around. Brussels is a bike-friendly city with dedicated bike lanes and a bike-sharing program, so you can rent a bike and get around the city with ease. Many of the top tourist attractions are within walking distance of each other, so you can choose to stay in the city centre and walk to all of the places of interest. There is a public transportation system here, which consists of a metro system and an extensive tram network that connects you to various neighbourhoods. The train in Belgium will connect you from Brussels to other cities in the region or you can take advantage of the hop on hop off bus tour that will take you around the popular attractions with narration about the city. This is a great option for those who just have a day or so in Brussels. We will leave the link to that in the description below. So now let's look at some of the typical prices. As with many European cities, the price of accommodation will vary depending on the time of your visit. Hostel dorm beds typically begin at around €60 Euros a night. A mid-range hotel room in the city centre will cost you between €140 to €200 Euros a night, whilst more luxurious options can range anywhere between €200 to €500 Euros a night. Breakfast can be found for under €6, Euros, whilst an affordable lunch at a local restaurant will cost you around €10. Euros. A sit-down dinner will cost you between €18 to €25, Euros, depending on the location of the restaurant. Brussels doesn't have to be a very expensive place to visit if you make budget-friendly choices. Firstly, there are many hostels in Brussels that you can take advantage of or you can take advantage of the Airbnb choices if you are travelling as a group. Stick to the public transportation like buses, trams and the metro and try as much as you can to walk between the attractions. If you would like to eat out, try the food at the local markets and street vendors and take advantage of the lunch menu specials as well. Get yourself a city pass to save money on multiple attractions. We will leave the link to that in the description below. You can also take advantage of the free attractions, such as the free walking tours, the parks and the gardens. Some museums in the city will also offer free admission days or hours, so check those before you visit. So now let's look at some of the best things to do. Firstly, you have to visit the Grand Place. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is Brussels Central Square, surrounded by historical buildings to visit. Next, visit the Atomium, the iconic structure built for the 1958 World Expo, which is a quirky, unique place to visit in Brussels. Stroll around Brussels to admire the unique statues in the city, then learn about the rich history of comic strips at the Belgian Comic Strip Centre. See a huge collection of vintage cars at Auto World Brussels, then indulge in a Brussels beer tour. Also, make sure to find some time to enjoy plenty of Belgian chocolates and waffles whilst you are here. Watch this video to find out about the 10 best cities to visit in Europe. Then to find out about the cheap places to visit in Europe, watch this video. We hope you have an incredible time in Brussels and stay creative.